What is up YouTube? It is your boy Merlity bringing you guys another video. And guys, today this video is not anything regarding anything to do my YouTube channel, um, to do with anything about gaming. This is more of a informative video for you guys that are out there. Um, I know a lot of YouTubers are making this video um, and I think it's really important for people that do understand what's going on in the world right now to share the info with other people that might not know what's going on. So I just wanted to come on here and no way in regards to anything, I'm not no medical professional, nothing like that. I don't know anything like that. I have never studied in medical. I don't have a degree, nothing. But I want to share what I want, what, what I know with you guys. Um, and that is guys, this coronavirus outbreak that's going on in the US right now, it's crazy. Um, and it's going to be going on for a while. People think there's going to be a recession. There's going to be a lot of issues going on um, that are going on right now. Like I went to uh, Rite Aid, Walmart. They're running out of paper towels, they're running out of water bottles, and like you know everything like that. So make sure you get all that supplies. But I'm going to show you guys the best way, and show and tell you guys the best ways to avoid um, getting in contact and how to prevent and how to stop the disease all in one. So. Number one is guys, if you are feeling sick, if you're feeling, if you're feeling, you know, just having headaches, throat, anything like that, take precautions. Um, I, in my opinion, I will tell you guys to do self quarantine, not even go outside, meaning uh, have your pantry full, have your water, have all the stuff that you would need from outside, have it in there prior in your house. So all you have to do is just go in your house, stay, don't go outside, stay inside. Um, self quarantine, I think, is the best way. It's the best way to um, stop the disease at it right there. Just halt it right away. Um, yes, the coronavirus is more dangerous in uh, more elderly people because it does attack the respiratory system, which affects your breathing. Um, one of the survivors said that um, that it felt like there was a heavy weight on his lungs and couldn't breathe. There is people surviving. Not everything results in death. Uh, death is a more of a scarier outcome, I guess, uh, which it is, and it should reach for everybody. But in my opinion, guys, this is only happening mostly in elderly people. The younger kids, there, I think there was in California, in regards to California, there was 247 cases of the coronavirus. Only two of them were kids that were 17 and younger. And those were those people that, those kids that were infected, had underlying symptoms already and had underlying problem prior to the coronavirus. So they had asthma, they had just a weak immune system which would make them more able to get that disease, you know, stuck on them quicker than us in regards of not making them different. But us meaning like, it, coronavirus is really hard to tra like transfer. You have to be really close contact. Like if someone has coronavirus and they cough on you, then yeah, you'll get it. But if you're cautious, you're washing your hands, and like you're using hand sanitizer here. Look, I'll show you. Look at this. I got hand sanitizer here at work. Um, so that's one way. I would do self quarantine. And if you are going to, and if you are feeling anything regarding your breathing, you're having issues breathing and stuff like that, call your <clears throat> closest health provider. Uh, it could be Med, Med Express, um, you know, anywhere. Call them prior, tell them that you're feeling symptoms of the the COVID, uh, which is coronavirus. So call them prior so they can have the proper, um, proper, like, you know, just properly introduce you to the, uh, to the medical field, I guess, in that way. Um, just make sure everything is ready for you. Make sure they have the glove, make sure everything is sanitized. It's, yes, it is, it is weird. A lot of people don't like to admit that you do have a virus, but it's better to admit it now than later. So make sure you guys are safe out there, washing your hands. Wash your hands for 20 seconds. Every time you go in the bathroom, wash for 20 seconds. I don't care if you just did this. Wash your hands for 20 minutes, 20 seconds. Every time. Hand sanitize. Do everything in, in your power to help you not get the disease. And guys, what I'm gonna tell you guys is, is just be safe, man. Is there's a lot of there's a lot of people out there that will, you know, you know, just pass the disease on not knowing what's going on with them. So just Make sure you guys are just self-cautious to yourself. Just take precautions and with everything. Just take precautions with everything. Touching anything. Picking up a phone, man. Phones. 
phone. Most dirtiest thing is money, money, like dollar bills. That's the dirtiest thing. A toilet seat is cleaner than a dollar bill. Keep that in mind. It's crazy to believe, but a dollar bill is dirtier. Money is dirtier than a toilet. So in, in that regards, guys, everything is dirty. Be safe out there. And if you guys want to know, know any, anything, um, I'm going to leave actual study study in the description down below where you can follow the link and you can read up on it if you want to know about it on it more. Just be safe out there, guys. I love you guys. Take care. Peace.